Hello and welcome to this B1 usability package e-learning session. In this session we'll be looking at how to performance profile the B1 usability package and how to help us figure out why a specific scenario is slow. Before starting out with this uh, demo I would like to talk a bit about performance in general. With SAP you have an add-on process and you have the SAP Business One process and the add-on process is going to take a certain amount of time for example if you add an item placement tool the add-on will need 0.5 seconds to process what it needs to do and then SAP will need 1.5 seconds to actually apply the customization so we as an SSP developer can only optimize the time spent by the add-on as SAP is responsible for optimizing the, the performance of the client in general we actually try to already optimize our add-ons to the very best performance but you might have a scenario that we have not found if you have a special use case you have many customization or customization that we have not tested or you have a large amount of data etc so if you have a scenario where you think SAP Business One with B1 usability package or one of our other add-ons runs unreasonably slow you need to create a support ticket with the support team and then you need to get a ticket number the ticket number you're going to use to associate a performance snapshot uh, with the specific ticket so that we can file it you also need to have access to boyomsolutions.com from the machine you want to profile from as we need to download some files and then you need to have access to boymit.com and the subdomains of boymit.com as we need to upload the snapshot uh, when the performance profiling is done. I have now opened up my SAP client and I have uh, B1 usability package running and I would like to in this example here figure out why the business partner master data uh, window takes a bit to open on my machine here it's actually really fast so you won't see any delay really but the scenario is that you have a window that's slow to open uh, B1UP is slow to start or you have a modification that is uh, slower than expected to figure out or help us figure out why this is slow we need you to take a snapshot that gives us uh, some data about what actually takes the time so that we can figure out if the issue is with our add-on code or with SAP. To get started with this uh, performance profiling you need to go up into help, Boyum support and here you will have the add-on name and then you need to select this one called performance profiling. The first time you click this one you will be notified that you need to download some files uh, onto the machine so that we can actually perform the profiling. So you need to press yes to this one and then you'll get a Boyum Profiler downloader that will actually download the required files and save them on the machine. Now the download is complete so we have the files that we need and you need to open the window again. It goes down here into the right corner so that you can keep on working uh, without it overlaying your work as you're going to need to open some windows again but basically it says here uh, what this tool does so it can help track down performance issues with an add-on by creating a snapshot that you can then send to us uh, it is important to note that no company data or sensitive data is recorded the snapshot is purely from a code perspective so it only shows how long each of the method calls on our code has actually taken and how the call chain is so it doesn't contain any company data from the database the steps you need to uh, complete to actually send the snapshot is you need to create a support ticket as I already said as a prerequisite then you need to press the start button here this will actually attach the profiler to our add-on then you need to perform the action in the client that you want to profile so in, in my case I want to open the business partner master data window then you press the stop button when you are done with the action and then you can repeat the steps again if you want to have multiple snapshots of different things 
If not, you just need to send the files to our support team. So I'll go ahead and I will press start. And the profiler is now starting and is uh, attaching to our add-on. And I now need to actually do the action inside the client that I want to profile on. So I'll go ahead and open the BP master data window. And as you can see it was uh, actually quite fast. But in a scenario where you have a window that's slow to open or you have a process that takes longer than expected, you need to start the profiler, then you need to perform the action and then you need to stop the profiler again. So the profiler is now stopping and as you can see here I have a new uh, snapshot, uh, a performance profile snapshot that I can now send to the BOEM support team. So I'll go ahead and click this button here and then I will be asked to upload uh, the snapshot and I need to specify my ticket number that is the ticket that this one is going to be associated with. So I'll go ahead and specify the ticket number that I got from the ticket I created with the support team and press upload. And now it's uploading the snapshot. So this might take a while depending on the internet uh, speed. But now the snapshot is uploaded and then you need to no notify the support team that you have uploaded uh, the snapshot. Now the uh, support team will now uh, send this to the developers who will actually look at the snapshot and will get back to you if something can be optimized or if it's something that needs to be fixed in the add-on code. It might also be that we cannot simply cannot optimize it anymore because all the time spent uh, <coughs> within the SAP uh, SDK but it's uh, always worth a shot to actually send us the snapshot so that we can see what the time uh, is spent on. If I open the window again we have a few additional options. So down here in other options you have the option to open the snapshots folder so this is where the snapshots uh, are being saved here. Uh, I uploaded them so I don't have any right now but you will see a list of zip files here uh, for each of the snapshots and you also have the option to clear this folder if you have made an incorrect snapshot uh, then you can simply just delete it. You also have the option to profile next startup so if you have really bad performance during startup you can actually go in and say I want to profile the next startup and if I click this then I'll get notified that when you start the add-on the next time on this machine for this specific user, the add-on will be profiled. So I can go ahead and say yes to this. It will tell me I need to restart the add-on to start the profiling. So I'll just go ahead and restart the add-on. and you'll notice that it will come up and say performance profiling during startup has been completed please open the performance profiling window and send the snapshot so now I actually have a snapshot of the startup process that I can send to the support team so if I open the snapshots folder again I'll also see that I now have a snapshot in here and that's the snapshot that represents uh, the startup This concludes this session on performance profiling. Thank you for watching.